in this video, I'm going to show what we've been working on recently. So we've been uh, working with Unreal to build a VTuber application. Um, this is an example um, of something that we're making for a friend of ours called Nick. He has a company called Tubers, uh, where they teach kids how to become uh, VTubers. Hello guys, Nick here. I'm here with Sam, who's on the camera. Hello. And we are at uh, Logitech stand today at VidCon in London. So this model is based on him and we've got this standard application. Hopefully we're going to be um, building this so uh, uh, you'll have options for different levels, a uh, green screen option, uh, maybe bringing different characters and all that type of stuff. But but this is a, an early stage uh, look at how it's going. So as you can see in here, we've got the character. It's linked up to uh, the iPhones. So all you need to run this is uh, this application and the iPhone link app. Uh, this character was created in uh, Character Creator 4. Um, so we've got a camera. Uh, the character will look at the camera. We've got triggered animations so that they can gesture and do things like that. And we can put on any animation that we want. I've got some animations on this character at the moment, but they're not built for this actual uh, model, so uh, they don't line up exactly. So we're just building some of them now. But you can, any uh, animation that you get, you can throw onto this character, yeah, so you can have him dancing. And doing all sorts of stuff. Uh, we can also add on facial triggers. Uh, so yeah, we can get um, add more expressive expressions. And again, something else that we're working on, the character can walk around the scene. Um, if that's something that they wanted to do, um, but again, the animations for this one aren't really set up for that, but it gives a good example. Uh, one of the other cool things about this is we've uh, realized that we can bring in uh, Vroid Studio characters. So if you want to do something with um, anime style uh, VTubers, uh, that's something that we can create also. I'll just get an example of that one up now. So this is an example of a Vroid Studio character uh, brought into Unreal. So we're just um, working on adding in features at the moment for this one. Things like having movement um, movement on the hair and the body, uh, which is simple to do. Uh, we can also add in facial expressions to trigger the character. And again, um, it's got triggers. And again, these aren't set up for this character, so they're not quite right. But it gives the idea of what, what we can do. And this character also can walk around the scene. And we've got to do a bit of work at getting those, that movement in the hair a little bit more natural. And we're going to do a little bit more work on the, um, the lip sync setup as well. Uh, try and get a bit more movement out of the face. So only put in the basic movements uh, so you haven't got like any mouth move left and right and things like that which um, all those little subtle movements really add to the character um, and its uh, animation. So we just wanted to share uh, what we've been working on and we'll keep on posting videos as we develop this more. Hopefully soon we'll have um, a full demo that we can put out and we and we're currently working on our website. Um, once that's complete, we will be adding demos of these so that people can download for free um, and test out and uh, use to make some uh, VTubing content. 